Okay, welcome back um, to our second session in English Conversation 2. Uh, please turn on your videos now. I'm going to send you again our uh, link to the attendance. Okay, here it is. Bagi yang belum ngisi absensi, silakan diisi. Dan yang di portal akan saya aktifkan sekitar jam 9 setelah ini ya. So you can fill it out by yourself. Okay, so I just click on the word traveling in, in Japanese. Is it is it correct to say ryoko? Ryoko means traveling. It, is it correct? Yes, sir. Okay. Yes, ryoko. sir. Is it correct? Okay, good. Nice. And when I said uh, traveling is um interesting hobby so uh, I'm, I'm i'm doing this see um it shows ryoko wa omoshiroi shumu shumi desu uh, is it correct okay wow mm, simply we can say ryoko wa omoshiroi desu okay without without shumi Okay, without shumi. Uh, shumi. Shumi is uh, like uh -huh. hobby, sir. Hobby. So I think, yes, sir. So I think if we use shumi is not relevant. Oh, for nice. Ryoko, sir. Wow, okay. So it says, Ryoko wa omo, omoshiroi shumi desu. Uh, this is the... Um, Okay, I, I took Japanese before. This is the letter. This is what it says. Is it correct? That's the way how it's uh, spelled. Um, it, yeah, it's it's very nice. I took uh, this characters. This is this combination between katagana and hiragana or kanji? So. Uh, is it a combination of hiragana and kanji, sir? Okay, hiragana and kanji. Because I think the yes, word, sir. I remember when I learned Japanese before, you use katakana when you don't have the hiragana form. Is it correct? Yes, sir. Okay. Yes, sir. Right. Is it correct? Mm -hmm. So I said to my uh, Japanese sensei, uh, his name is Marutani sensei. Mm -hmm. he, he was from um, Tokyo. I asked him, sir, uh, what do you think about my name? Because my name is from Arabic, uh, Shahid. Uh, and, and he said, Shahidu, Shahidu, Shahida. So there is no consonant. Is it true? For example, Fidia, we uh, Japanese character doesn't have H at the end. Yes, sir. Uh, hmm. In Japanese, uh, like what um uh, if we if we not uh japanese original japanese origin we use katakana for our name sir mm, okay for the for the name so uh for example like like your name fidia uh i have um when i learned japanese the teachers say that in japanese they don't have any con consent everything is focal like fidia there is no ah, an, except san, san. Okay, how do you uh, spell that in Japanese? Still fidia or it becomes something else? Uh, in Japanese, uh, I uh, fidia spell what? Like V G N A, just oh. and and yeah, just V D N A. C D N A. In katakana, oh yeah, because it, B it does D C. N A. Okay, V D N A. So if I try to type in here, it becomes V D uh, V D A. Is it like this? Yes. Exactly, sir. Is it okay. correct, sir? Okay, it's correct. Wow, nice. This is technology. Okay, actually, I I have almost forgotten the katakana hiragana form I, I i learned that a few years ago before okay now we come back to traveling it's very nice conversation now because i also learn from you okay uh, it's just happy to learn 
and traveling. Anybody want to talk about their favorite spot in uh, in Japan? Uh, Jalita with Osaka. Uh, yes, Yashashi. Oh, Yashashi. I I have heard the word Yashashi uh, Raman. Yashashi means uh, is it sim simple or uh, what is the meaning of Yashashi? Yashashi. Yes. Other, other kindness. Kind. Oh, kindness. Yashashi. Oh, so this, so this. Okay. Um. Any anybody want to talk about Japanese traveling? When you I don't know when I when I traveled to Japanese at the time I uh, came to Narita Airport. Uh, Narita, it's I think Narita Airport is in Tokyo, yeah, Tokyo, uh, for the first time, and I think. Narita was such a huge place for you to, to visit. Now I'm, I'm asking you about uh, Japanese culture, okay? Uh, traveling, of course, you will meet the, the culture, the food, the places. What is the meaning of the Japanese flag? Anyone wants to describe that Japanese flag? Mm -hmm. Want to talk about that, Dinda? You, you travel to Japan and then you see a Japanese flag in the airport. What I understand is that Japanese really respect their uh, nation flag. Can anybody tell me what is the meaning of the Japanese flag? You know, you know the, the flag? Okay, want to talk about the Zakia? Mm -hmm. you, you didn't say anything <laughs> from the beginning. Yeah, you, you, you were still silent. What, what happened? Mm -hmm. Okay. Is, do you know a uh, Japanese flag is made of? Uh, I think the picture is like this. Uh, hold on, let me check in my uh, my phone. It says. Uh, mm -mm -mm. Keep talking. Japanese flag. Okay, here it is. Mm -hmm. Okay, here. This is this one. I'm searching for Japanese. I don't know. I, I see these two pictures here, right here with this one and right here with this. No, can can anybody tell me what what does it mean with that American flag? Mm -hmm. I think so, uh, the flag in the Japanese in 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 sir picture in number one because uh in the flag are uh, two color mm -hmm. uh, red and uh white mm -hmm. and i uh, uh i look in internet in in i look but uh in flag japanese to mm -hmm. uh two color and uh white White, uh, like honesty, mm. uh, symbol honesty, honesty mm. and integrity, uh, mm. and 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 color red like uh, like uh, sun, mm -hmm. like sun. sun, the sun. Okay, uh, yes, the the sun. Oh, that's why it's that's why I remember. Uh, Japan was known as the the country of the sunrise, sunrise, okay, sunrise, and in, in early in the morning, and it, that's what I've heard. And the color is, I think it's really closely related to our flag, right, Indonesian. Our Indonesian flag is also red and white. Japanese is also red and white. 
Do you think that they have close relation? Mm -hmm. Do you think so? Indonesian flag? I think. Mm -hmm. Yes. I think it's, uh, it's the white one. Oh, okay. Some similarity. similarity with the white one, uh, not the red one. Mm, okay. No. <laughs> right. Now, su suppose that you travel to Japan and then you uh, landing. You are landing from your airplane in the airport and then you want to pick up your suitcases or your baggage, baggage claim, and you meet the uh, airport officer. What, what will you say in Japanese for the first time um, saying like this, I want to go to, um, to the hotel? What would you say? Mm -hmm. What would you say? <laughs> yes? Alexander Rivera, <laughs> you're hiding. Your, your, your video is off. You haven't said anything yet. Was that, yeah. Are you there, Alexander? Uh, okay. Uh, okay. You, 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 yes. Mm -hmm. uh, <coughs> hotel, hotel. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Mm. What will you say? I want to go to the hotel. Hotel Runi Ikpai. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. This is excellent. You know, we speak in two languages, two foreign languages. You should be proud. I'm talking to you in English and then we talk about Japanese language. That's awesome. It means that you are not stupid. <laughs> you are clever, okay? You have to believe that you are clever. Um, not, it's not easy. Your, your mother tongue is Bahasa Indonesia or Minangkabau language or any other ethnic languages in this country. Then we talk about Japanese. That's awesome. That's very awesome. And you say hotel. So you put the word hotel at the beginning, hotel, and then what else? Mm -hmm. And we just say hotel eikitai, uh, sir. Hotel eikitai. Is it? Yes, sir. Oh, okay. Yes, yes, sir. yes sir. Okay, good. It's nice. Hotel eikitai. Um, imagine how many languages do you speak? Uh, you speak Bahasa Indonesia, English, Minangkabau, or Minangkabau Kitingi, Minangkabau Pariaman, Minangkabau. <laughs> I don't know what, what, what type of Minangkabau. Even, even, in, even in one language, Minangkabau, we have so many types, right? So many accents. Now you learn Japanese and you also know English. And for for Muslim, if you could read Al Quran, it means that you add one more language, Arabic. That's uh, awesome. For um, other relig religion, they might learn Latin. Uh, I think it was yeah for Christian that they learn Latin, and for other religion they learn Hebrew languages. That's that's a, that's amazing. You need to really understand and know that. And we talk about traveling again. I'd like to hear from Zakia. Come on, Zakia, say something. Uh, where do you want to go in Japan one day? Uh, Kyoto, sir. Kyoto, why? Um, because many historical relics um, are related to the Japanese mm -hmm. um, imperial court. Um, mm. I like um, anything related to history, sir. So in Kyoto, there are um, many historical buildings that I want to visit. Kyoto, mm. Can you can you tell us uh, one of the historical buildings? The example. Um, What can you can you name it? 
let me try to see uh, Japanese historical. Um, okay, here. Mm -hmm. Can you say pagoda? Is it pagoda in Japan? Pagoda. Is it? Oh, that, oh, that belongs to Chinese. Oh, I see this picture. Yeah, so this picture. Um, okay. Right, this is the picture. Can anybody tell me what, what building is this? Okay, do you know what? Okay, what building is that, Zakia? I think, uh, is it related to mystery, horror, or uh, spiritual worship or something? This one? I show you again. Some spiritual, maybe, sir. Spiritual, oh, okay. <laughs> All right, that's that's very interesting. All right. Uh, wow. What else? And uh, what about this one? Mm, okay. Okay, all right, here it is. This is also interesting. Maybe anybody wants to, to, to talk about this one? Is it, does it belong to Japanese or Chinese? Japanese. Japanese, okay. Well, why, what do you mean with, with this building? Can anybody tell me what, what is the function of this building? Wow, it's, it's very nice. Um, I you know. think it's a mm -hmm. temple, sir. It's a temple. Yeah, look at there. Yes, so, sir. It's, it's my opinion, sir. Okay, look, look, look at there. I'm not sorry. It's so many people right there. See, so many people visit the place. It's very nice. Um, yeah, I like Japanese culture, Japanese cultural festival. You talk about places, right? Osaka, Kyoto, Tokyo, uh, um, Tokoshi. Oshima and uh, some other places. Now I'd like to talk about food. Food in from Japan. What is the nicest food that you have ever tasted? Ramen, maybe. Udon. <laughs> noodle. Noodle. Ramen noodle. Oh. <laughs> okay. Yes, sir. Uh, ramen and who said just now, Tiara? You want to say something? Udon. 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 Udon or udon? Udon. 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 <laughs> udon. Oh, okay. It's just uh. Mm -hmm. Yes. Sir. Udon. Udon, but we we spell like udon with G and G. With, uh, but the hmm? but we write like udon. Mm. We spill yeah, like, mm -hmm. we spill like udon, sir. Oh, okay. Because uh, in Japanese language is, if we, if the word uh, ended by consonant, and it will spell by ng, like mm. udon, it, it will be udon. Okay. Uh, so, okay, now let me to use that, that uh, concept. Uh, Fidel V said that when a word in Japanese ends with N, so we should add G, like Evelina Sang, right? Evelina Sang. Now, uh, Evelina Limbertnia, okay, that's focal. Now, I like to see your name, for example, ah, with the N, Arahman. <laughs> so, can I say in spelling Arahman, but when I say it, Arahman, is it like that? Or it doesn't work for name. Um, I think it's don't work for name, sir. Mm. Uh, because as we as we had our our mm -hmm. our teacher like spell our name, mm -hmm. it's 
not work to our name, sir. Okay, makes sense. That that makes sense. All right, it's very interesting. Wow, it's been long, and you were very active, and still keep talking like that, and it's very nice. You know, at first I thought that we're going to have our class like this every every day, every week, but then you need theories as well, right? Um, okay, someone is sending the chat. What is that? I'm here, but I can open the camera because I've got disabled. Okay, what's wrong with that? Disabled. Andre, where is that? Uh, Muhammad Hadil Mufti. Does, is, it, is he left? Alexandre Rivera? Are you there? Oh, there. Oh, yeah. yeah I can I'm see here. you. Now, oh. is there anything you would like to talk about Japan? No. Is, uh, no. <laughs> Are you sure? Are you sure? No. <laughs> Come on. Don't give up. Come on. Say something. <laughs> uh, mm -hmm. I'd like to cut. I'd like to talk here. Yeah. To Tokyo. Why? Yes. Why? Because be, uh, because the when the next comes, uh, mm -hmm. the view the view is so so beautiful. Uh, and uh, mm -hmm. uh, it's comfortable. It's very comfortable for in me. Tokyo. In Tokyo. Yes. So, yes. have you been to Tokyo? <clears throat> what? Then? Have Can you, you been again? Have you have you been in Tokyo? Nah. No. No. Okay. So you how do you like that? From where you like that? Sorry wa doshite desu ka. Is it correct? Sorry wa doshite desu ka. Uh, why why is that why sorry wa sorry wa doshite desu ka why come on tokyo um, um. <laughs> yes come on alexander i don't want to give you low score okay so keep talking <laughs> uh huh why i haven't heard um. from dinza from dinda as well while Alexander is trying to speak, we also like to, to hear from Linda. Okay. Okay, Alexander. Uh, okay, sir. Okay, okay. All right. 50-50. <laughs> okay. Um, all right. So now, Dinda, Dinda Saida, is there any places in Japan that you would like to go one day? Maybe traveling Japan, Disney, Tokyo. Disney. Sure. Disney, Disney in Tokyo. Disney. Wow. So do you like Disney? Uh, yes. yes. Because uh, at night, the views is beautiful because uh, of the mm -hmm. light. Mm. Views are yeah, beautiful. Okay. Because since you said that you like Disney, do you have any specific Disney character you like? Yes. Disney character? Mm -hmm. Can you can you tell me one? Many Disney like um, Cinderella or <laughs> um, Pocahontas or which one? Mickey Mouse. Oh, Mickey Mouse. Oh, I see. Mickey Mouse is cute. It's very cute. Uh, it's quite gentle. Okay. All right. So I guess uh, that's enough for today. Our midterm test, nine, and like I said, until 9, uh, 14 is not going to be that long. So that was our English conversation too. Keep talking. That's what I said. And you have to convince yourself that you are you are smart, you are clever, and don't compare. Don't compare because when you compare yourself with others, uh, you are not fair because you will see the strength of others and then you try to downgrade 
yourself. Don't don't never do that because we were each one of us is born unique and special. That's what you need to believe in that. Okay, so that's for our test today. Ujian tengah semester because our class is English conversations and speaking and talking. So and for our final exam one day, we will have like this once again. It's not going to be that very theoretical. Okay, our subject is not theoretical. It's a practical, simple, and straightforward. I don't want you to memorize everything. Because you, the focus is speaking. You, you say it. The same thing with Japanese. You need to talk and have conversation in Japanese. The more you converse, the more you elaborate. Anybody wants to say something before we split? Before we took off? Mm -hmm. Okay. All right. Um, thank you so much for coming. And I like to say, Arigato gozaimas and uh, Fidialfi. Thank you for being so active in this, in this event. Uh, Rifki Sani, uh, mm. one day you will meet with uh, Sasuke or Naruto. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Tiara, with your Korean boy band group. Uh, Yashashi Rahman, you can dive one day to the most beautiful island in this world and Hefelina enjoy the the nice and tasty pempe <laughs> and uh, Alexander Rivera okay keep talking uh, and Muhammad Hadil Mufti I don't know what what happens with your videos and Daviano oh I see a picture of a moon right there Jelita Maharani and I don't see Jadang does he left already I think he, he left. Okay, all right. Dinda, Muhammad Iqbal, um, Farenza Jewel, and Muhammad Hadil Mufti, thank you for coming. Um, oh, Muhammad Hadil, you didn't say anything. Want to say something about Japan, Japanese? Is that Japanese? Mm -hmm. Come on, we hear you. Yeah. Do you have anything to say about Japanese? I don't say anything, sir. Mm -hmm. Any particular favorite place or food that you like? I think I don't like about Japanese there. <laughs> you don't like about Japanese? Yeah. But you take Japanese department. Wow, how come? I don't know that. You, you don't know. Um, uh, you, yeah. you, if you, uh, well, people say that when you choose something and you don't know why you choose it, it means that you love it. Ketidaksengajaan yang, yang indah. Oh, accidental. Accidental love, yeah. yeah. Accidental love. People, the same thing with, the same thing with your parents, maybe with your, um, uh, girlfriend or boyfriend or someone that you like when people ask you why do you like him or why do you like her and then you said i don't know i don't know i just i just like it so it, that's love it means you love japanese <laughs> all right i've been talking too much today okay so uh thank you for Sir? yes excuse me yes uh, i didn't say anything Okay, keep talking. Otherwise, we will we will left you behind. Okay, you want to say something, Ulfaiza? Uh, about Japanese. Mm -hmm. I want to Kawaguchi, like oh, to Kawaguchi. see Fuji Mountain. Fuji Mountain, that's beautiful. Yes. Why? Why? Uh, because Fuji Mountain it has a beautiful view. Mm -hmm. Wow. Mm. And I want to uh, Disneyland. Disneyland, the same with Dinda. Dinda Sahida. Yeah. Dinda Dinda likes Mickey Mouse. What about you, Faiza? Yes, I like Mickey Mouse too. Oh, the same Mickey Mouse. Oh, yeah. you should share. 
<laughs> you share together the Mickey Mouse. Okay, right. Um, nice conversations. Thank you uh, for having this uh, beautiful conversation. Uh, okay, Dandang. Dandang is joining with us uh, right now. So next week, we will have our 10th meeting, uh, November 22nd. This is about life at work. <clears throat> it's very nice conversation. Thank you for coming. And I, I'm not going yeah. to give. Yes, who wants to speak? I will tell you. Iqbal, OK. Want to talk? OK, go on. Uh -huh. uh, yes. Uh. I went to visit um, Akibahara. Akibahara, where's that? Is it? It's Japanese. Yeah, uh, yeah I know. I'm mean, uh, closer to Kyoto, Tokyo, or next to. Because I really like my cafe there. Um, okay. So, why do you choose that place? Why? I don't know, sir. You don't know. Okay. All right. Really? And what what is the special thing about that place? Akibara. Mm. Akibara, right? Yes, yeah. Okay. What is the special thing of that place that you want to visit? What is it? Mm -hmm. okay. For example, like Evelina chose Palembang because she wanted to taste the pempe, for example, okay? And what about you, Mama Nikba? You said Akibara. Why do you choose that place? Mad Cafe. Mad Cafe. Uh, uh -huh. Yes, yeah. <laughs> okay. What is the thing that you find in the cafeteria? Is it cafeteria? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yes, sir. Okay. What, what food or drink that you would like to uh, try there? What food? Or drink. Come on, what food or drink? <laughs> Just say any food that you have in your mind. Uh huh. Ramen soup. Ramen. Ah, oh, okay, nice. Ramen. Ramen noodle. Um, I think uh, is it true that when you eat ramen noodle, uh, the noodle doesn't have oil. No oil at all. Um, is it true? Is it true, Bal? Ramen. Have you ever tried ramen? Yes, sir. Yes. Okay. Come on. Uh, <laughs> have you tried ramen before? Huh? Yes, sir. Yes. Uh, where? Where? Where is that? Where? You Padang. said Padang. Padang. Okay. Which which store? I want to try. Which store in Padang that that sell ramen noodle? Is it in Ulakarang? Gore, sir. Oh, Gore. Gore. <laughs> okay. Gore. Nice, nice. Have you been to? Uh, all of you have been there, consuming uh, ramen in Gore. All of you. Not yet, sir. Not yet. No. Not yet. Okay. Um, okay. One day I would like. I would like to try ramen noodle. It's very nice. Um, I uh, yesterday we had a meeting with the department. I met Mr. Oslan as the chair of Japanese department and some other lecturers. I heard that next semester, probably, our class will be conducted face to face or offline. So if you are in other outside of town or outside of Padang or outside of West Mantra province right now, maybe next semester we're going to have offline meeting. So thank you for coming. That's very nice conversations with all of you. And thank you for trying Muhammad Iqbal. And that's very helpful. Um, okay, still there. And have a good day today for all of you. And uh, best of luck. Uh, Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Good morning.
Bye-bye. 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 B